Kirikoto. I'm Lucy and I'm going to tell you what I'm doing for my well-being at the moment. So firstly, let's just recognise that um, times are tough and I don't want to diminish that in any way. So what I am doing is number one, I'm being very determined about pacing myself. So I think, if I'm honest, every single day this week, I have been taking myself off for a nana nap. And during the day, if I'm feeling anxious, then I practice box breathing, where you breathe in for the count of four, you hold your breath for the count of four, you breathe out for the count of four, you hold your breath for the count of four. So I go in, three, four, hold, two, three, four, out, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four. And it just gives my rational brain an opportunity to take over from my emotional runaway train brain. So um, I hope those things, some of those things might help you too. And we're thinking of everybody out there who is trying to get through this together. Kiara. Morning. 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 Hey, morning everyone. Hey, Ismail, what have we been up to during this lockdown period? Um, we've been going for a walk mm -hmm. and watching movies, yeah. workouts, workouts, jobs, and baking, and right, okay. Anything else you want to say to you? Bye. Yeah. See ya. Hey, look, we've just been keeping it really chilled here at home um, during the lockdown period. Uh, hope you all are well out there. Uh, big thing is just keep your rhythms up. Um, yeah, again, do the things that, that, that give you life. Uh, like like Ismail was saying, ours is to work out as a family together. We do some walks. Again, just keep it really chilled. Stay, stay safe out there. We'll talk soon, eh? Kia ora. Uh, firstly, uh, the most important thing that I see and that um, I believe is um, right at the top of our, where our focus should be is ho water and the well-being. So looking at Te Whare Tapa Whā, hau ora, so we've got Taha Hene Ngaro, Taha Wairua, Taha Whānau, Taha Tinana, and they're all interconnected. Um, so looking at ways to enhance that whilst we are in this lockdown. What I've been uh, doing with my uh, rangatahi is I set up a lip sync challenge, that was in my first week, um, that was awesome. Got to see snapshots of my students that I'd never see um, usually, um, and same with me as well. Um, I was a part of that, so I had to do a song. We're cooking blueberry muffins uh, for Fano um, and gonna try and bring Fano involved, get Fano involved in that, into that as well. So building that, um, those relationships there as well. And so I'm building this narrative for them during this COVID lockdown, so that when I get back to school, whenever that is, we can go back and have a look at those lip syncs. We can go back and uh, look at the feedback for their baking of muffins or, or anything like that. And that just maintains my connection with my with my students so that when I go back to school, um, they're not having to rediscover me and I'm not having to rediscover them. Uh, no reira, uh, tēnā koutou, tēnā ratatou, katoa.